Set up strong VPN Open VPN on Asus router stock firmware. Before you start you need to get your VPN account credentials from the Strong's customer area. To log into the customer area you need to use your email with us as a login. The password is the one that you've created when you first made an order, if you haven't changed it since then, of course. You can log in from the Strong VPN website, there is a link at the top, if that doesn't work, the direct link to the customer area login page is, https colon slash slash intranet dot strong vpn dot com slash services slash intranet. If you cannot remember your password, please reset it using this link, https colon slash slash intranet dot strong vpn dot com slash services slash intranet slash password underscore reset. After logging in hover over VPN accounts at the top, then click the menu item VPN account summary. Click get open VPN config file near the open VPN slash ipsec account. Scroll down the page and you will find the configuration file, it is required for setup, please download it. Depending on the OpenVPN server settings you will either see one or two download buttons, if you see two please download the Linux slash Mac config file doesn't matter which device you are setting up. Windows config file is used for OpenVPN GUI application setup on Windows system only. If you are using our new type OpenVPN servers on this page you will also see your account setup credentials, username and password. If you don't see them, just ignore the steps where username and password are mentioned. Please notice, the credentials on the screen above will not work this is just an example. We recommend to leave account setup instructions window open, since you will need this information for setup. Make sure that you have credentials at hand until you finish. Supported models BRTAC 828, Onhub SRTAC 1900, Raj Rapture GTAC 5300, RTAC 51U slash R, RTAC 53, RTAC 5300, RTAC 55U slash R, RTAC 56U slash R slash S, RTAC 66R, RTAC 66UB1, RTAC 68U slash R, RTAC 86U slash R, RTAC 87U slash R, RTAC 88U slash R, RTAC RH13, RTAC 1200, RTAC 1200 HP, RTAC 1750, RTAC 1900, RTAC 1900P, RTAC 3100, RTAC 3200, RTN 12, RTN 12D1, RTN 16, RTN 18 U slash R, RTN 600, RTN 66 U slash R. This page describes the manual setup of the OpenVPN connection on Asus router. This setup requires you to upload the config file manually. This kind of setup can cause some inconvenience, for example if you need to use some video streaming services, the DNS settings of the router need to be updated manually as well. Default information, default router IP address, 192.168.1.1 username, admin password, admin Wi-Fi 2.4 GHz network name, SSID ASUS Wi-Fi 5 GHz network name, SSID ASUS underscore 5G Wi-Fi password is not set by default. Please note, if you do not see the ASUS underscore 5G network it means that your ASUS router either doesn't support the 5.8 GHz band, for example, ASUS RTN 10P does not support it, or the receiving device, computer, phone, tablet etc., has no 5.8 GHz wireless support. In this case, use the ASUS network. 1.First You need to prepare the config file, because ASUS firmware doesn't parse certain OpenVPN options correctly. You have already got this configuration file from the customer area at the beginning of this tutorial. If you are not sure where to get it, scroll up the page, you can find the instructions there. After that open it with the text editor, we have used Ubuntu system for this tutorial and Godite application as the editor. For Mac OS you can use text edit, for Windows, Notepad application. In the open file find the remote option and check the last word in this line. It can be either UDP or TCP. Your config file will look similar, but not exactly the same, options order and number may vary. Add the line proto UDP or proto TCP depending on the protocol that you saw in the remote option. Save the file. 2. Connect to the ASUS router via an Ethernet cable or wirelessly. The computer should be cabled to a LAN port of the VPN router or connected to ASUS or ASUS underscore 5G network. Open up your web browser, type in 192.168.1.1 in the address bar and hit enter. It will prompt you to enter the username slash password. The default values are, admin, username, and admin, password. Once you log in, go to VPN option in the left hand side menu. Select VPN client tab and click add profile button. 3. Choose. Open VPN tab in the appeared window, fill the fields. Description is the name of the connection, it can be any as you like, we recommend to set it to strong VPN. Please note, if you already have the connection with the same name it will not let you save the settings. If you are using our new OpenVPN servers, basically if your config file name starts with str letters, 
you will need to fill the username and password. Username and password are your credentials that you obtained from the customer area. Do not use SXXXXXXX and XXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXXX